some some news to share with us today. Can you please share your news? Yeah, um, today I've officially announced my retirement from Test cricket. Um, obviously, I've, it's not a decision I just made overnight. I've had some time after the World Cup to think about to think about things. Um, and yeah, fortunately, I've decided to step down. Um, I've done exactly what my heart is telling me what to do. Um, but yeah, in saying that, I'm fully committed to the to the white ball format uh, for the team. Um, I'll still be there with the team um, for a long haul. Um, so yeah, it's not the last that I'll be around with this team. You said that you did put a lot of thought to it. Obviously, there's been a few conversations as well with people that you know you you with the people that advise you best. Yes, obviously, um, I've spoken to a lot of people who are closest to me. Um, a lot of good heads that keep me that keep me let's say humble at the best of times. Um, they keep me, kept me level-headed um, when it comes to important decisions. They, they're the people I go to, and they, and yeah, we spoke about it. Um, it took quite a while, um, and yeah, we've come. I've come up with this final decision of obviously me stepping down um, from from this format. There's a lot of exciting things that are taking place in your own life. Um, you know, you're about to start a really exciting journey as a parent for the very first time. Um, tell us about how that this new milestone has affected or, or um, assisted you in making this decision. Yeah, obviously, um, obviously I've got an, uh, a, a baby on the way um, in the next couple of days. Um, you know, just one of the factors um, that was part of my decision, one of the small factors. Um, obviously, you know, I, I'm a big family guy. I, I really want to be there for my kids growing up. Um, so yeah, it's one of the main factors. Um, so yeah, I'm quite excited. I uh, don't know, don't know how I'm gonna go about it. Obviously, my first time. Um, but yeah, um, like I'll do what Quinny does. Is just take it as it comes. Um, so yeah. Lots of nerves, but also a bit of excitement. Yeah, to be honest, um, I'm not too sure. My emotions are not not quite too sure. I don't know whether to be excited, nervous. Um, you know, so like I said, I'm going to take it as it comes. It's a, it's quite a big thing for me. Um, when I was, when I was 19, 20, I didn't think I'll ever have kids. So, and at this moment now, I've got one on, on the way in the next couple of days. So it's quite a big thing for me. And yeah, like I said, I really want to be there for for the for the baby um, as she grows up. I really want to be part of her of her childhood. Um, so yeah. Quite nervous. Um, also, you know, quite a few people would have will make a bit of assumptions or a few assumptions around, you know, bubble life and and things like that, um, and just how much time Test cricket takes out of your life. Um, would you say that that was part of it, or is it just like one of those contributing factors, or not at all? Yeah, like like I said, um, there's a lot of con contri contributing uh, factors. Um, obviously, that a lot of those things are. To, to think about, um, you know, it's also just time away. Um, I would say at this point of the year, this year, I've, I think I spent um, a good six and a half months out of the country. Um, that's just out of the country, um, let alone the tours that we had at home. Um, so it's obviously, it's it's one of the things, um, but I've got a lot of reasons. But like I said, it's not something I just woke up and just made a decision of I uh, really gave thought about it. it's obviously a big decision because it's the ultimate format of the of the game so uh, I didn't take this decision likely uh, likely um, so so it's it's just quite a tough one but like I said um, I'm doing what my heart is telling me what's best and finally just a word to you know your fans and to Proteus fans who have supported you throughout your test career yeah obviously it's been amazing I mean the, the support that I've had uh, through my through my ups and most importantly through my downs, um, you know, it's something that no professional sportsman can just buy is support of fans. It's, they've been absolutely amazing. Um, you know, it's it's been awesome when you walk down the stairs here at a couple of stadiums in South Africa and you got the fans cheering you on. It's absolutely amazing. But 
in saying that it's only I'm only done with test cricket uh, I'm not done with with the white ball format so I'll still be around for a long time